Welcome to Tonight with Cassidy. We are kicking it off tonight with a former star football player from U of O teaming up with Blue Star Donuts. Yes, quarterback Dennis Dixon led the Ducks a dozen years ago, and now he is here in Portland and right here in our studio for the unveiling of a new donut, which of course pays tribute to your duck roots because it is very green and we will get to the, try the donut in a few minutes. I'm very excited. I like the name of it. I like what it has in it. It's right there. I am getting distracted. But first, we're going to talk sports for a minute. So most people know you as Oregon's quarterback back in the day. Of course, went on to win just a little thing called uh, two Super Bowls. Congratulations. Thank you so much. I feel honored to be in your presence. But I also read something today. Is it true? You also played baseball? You baseball almost went a whole separate path? Yes, I did. You know, Atlanta Braves. I got drafted by the, by the Atlanta Braves in the fifth round, which is amazing. So I'm blessed just to be a, be a multiple sport athlete for sure. That's so cool. Yeah, so quarterback for the Ducks. Right now, they've won nine. The Ducks currently have won nine games in a row. Yeah. How are you feeling about the Ducks' season? Are they going to make the playoffs? What's yes, going to happen here? I like, I like our chances. I mean, um, the sky's the limit for this team. All we got to do is continue to answer the bell and just let the chips fall where they may. Um, just continue to answer. That's all I can ask for. So Justin Herbert, most people probably heard his name. He's made a big name for himself and will probably continue to make his name even bigger when the draft comes up. And you were drafted after your time at Oregon. Any advice for Justin? Because we know he's watching right yes. now in all of his free time. He's probably sitting a donut, eating a donut, watching from home. Yes. Any advice? I would just say embrace the moment. Continue to have fun. Continue to put the team first. Um, and, and things will fall into place for him. And uh, when it comes to off season for him, I would love to kind of really work with him <laughs> as well, too, seeing that I was a, a former quarterback and being where I was, where he wants to be. So I would love to help it by any means possible. Maybe in his free time he can just hang out and eat donuts. Absolutely. I would love that. Love now, it. last question before we get to the donuts. They smell really good, by the way. Next weekend, the weekend after Thanksgiving, is the Civil War game. Yes. Beavers versus Ducks. What is that like as a quarterback or as just a member of the team going into that game? And it's a rush. It rushed. Um, in the state of this Oregon, I mean, either you're green or you're, you're orange. Uh, I rather like green. <laughs> like my donut, which is awesome. So I'm looking forward to that. But it should be a hard fought game, and I'm looking forward to it. Amazing. Okay, well, other things, you know, there's fights fought hard in the kitchen when you're trying to figure out where do we go? What direction? What play are we going to call to make this donut? So we're walking over here to Chef Stephanie Thornton with Blue Star with this new donut, which you guys have perfectly named Matcha Matcha Man. <laughs> yeah, I mean, not us. It was one of. Dennis's fans, yes. so they got we did. One a of your fans named yeah. the donut. Yeah. I really wanted to open it up to my fans and really kind of have them just really into it as well too. And it's a great moment right now, it really is. And so the donut not only looks good, and I'm sure it will taste good, but it also will help raise money for breast cancer, yes. which is in honor of your mother and the mom of the CEO of Blue Star, Katie, yep. right? Yeah. Yes, yes, for sure. And tomorrow. People actually have a chance to meet you? Yes. Try this donut? Yes. What? Signing autographs and everything. So <laughs> I'm looking forward to it at the flagship at 9 a.m. And you'll actually be doing some glazing? Are you going to be making donuts? Oh, if you oh, come yes. to my donut shop, you come to work. Yes. What? <laughs> I learned a lot from chefs, so she put me to work right, right when I was in there, and I'm ready to go tomorrow. So ready tell us about this donut. What is in Matcha Matcha Man? Clearly it is green. It involves some matcha, some yes. green tea, right? Yes, yeah. So um, it has a uh, lime maple syrup um, coating on it, a, a simple syrup that it's dunked in to kind of give it a nice uh, lime, you know, flavor, sweetness, a little uh, moisture. And then wow. this fantastic matcha glaze that we've got over here. Um, it's with Japanese matcha that actually comes from the same uh, neighborhood as our Japanese general manager. She was what? so impressed that when I got it, she's like, that's from where I live. Yes. That's so crazy. We really said, small I world. That. I, thought, I gotta have that. Yeah. Right? Got excited. Do you yes. love matcha? Because I know some people yes. at home, they might be thinking, maybe I've never really tried matcha or I haven't tried the right matcha. I love matcha, yes. but I know it can somehow, some people don't like it. Why should people try this? Will everyone love this donut? Oh, this donut's amazing. It's got like a salty crumble. It's got almonds, matcha. And I would say we did a matcha donut years ago and it has been, asked for repeatedly. <laughs> so we're coming back with a new and improved Dennis style matcha donut. Yes. 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 Can we try it? Can I yeah, try well, it? I don't know. Okay. You're, you're going yes, you to make one? Oh, yes. Are you going to show us your donut I can do that skills? For sure, I can. <laughs> oh, my Chef. gosh. Traded the, the ducks test. uniform for an apron yes. and now glazing donuts. And here we go. 
Oh my gosh. Oh yeah. This is, <laughs> need some more hands for that. This is what? going in. What's more difficult, like throwing a touchdown pass or glazing and decorating a donut perfectly? Oh. I'd say probably that, probably for the most part. <laughs> yes. I mean, one, you were born with at least some natural yes. talent. Maybe there yes. were some natural donut talents. It's going in. That were always there. Yes. <laughs> it's making you the perfect. Yes. Oh my gosh. It's going down. Okay, so we got the glaze. Beautiful. Yeah. And then what, how do you, oh, are you going oh, yeah. to then, then switch right to the non-glazed hands? Then we go to the non-glazed. Wow. Yeah. How and much practice, crumble, like how, is how long style. have you been working on your donut skills? To be honest, it's been a while. It takes <laughs> practice. It takes practice to perfect, and I think I'm there now. Oh, and my gosh. Voila. So the Matcha Matcha Man Donut. People can come try it tomorrow yes, at Blue Star. Can. What time do they need to get there to hang out with you, Dennis? 9 a.m. to 12. 9 to noon. And then how long will the donut be on the menu? Oh, it's going to make it through the end of the year for sure. Yes. Um, you know, if you guys holler and yell that you want to keep it, we'll keep it. Uh, we're yes. making 350 donuts for tomorrow. So, you know, it, we are going to try our best to keep it for the whole day at every location as much as we can. Oh, my gosh. Well, thank you, guys. Can we get it? I have to keep Excited. talking, so I promise I will taste this in the commercial break because it sounds amazing. But here's what's coming up. We have a unique twist on a bar crawl. That one's dead.